What if the source of all your struggles and conflicts lies within you? What if the key to personal transformation and a fulfilling life is right here, right now? These are questions that Eckhart Tolle prompts us to consider in his book, A New Earth, Awakening to Your Life's Purpose. Tolle, a spiritual teacher known for his thoughtful explorations on consciousness and presence, takes us on an enlightening journey. In A New Earth, Tolle builds upon the ideas presented in his previous work, The Power of Now, and explores themes related to personal transformation and the evolution of human consciousness. He invites us to look inward, to recognize and transcend the limitations of our ego-driven selves, and awaken to a deeper, more authentic state of being. This is not just a book, but a guide, a beacon, a spiritual roadmap, for those seeking to navigate the path of self-discovery and spiritual awakening. Let us embark on this journey of self-discovery and spiritual awakening as we delve into the key concepts of a new earth. At the heart of human suffering and conflict lies a single entity, the ego. This ego, as described by Eckhart Tolle, is more than just an inflated sense of self-importance. It's a false self, a mask, created by unconscious identification with our thoughts and emotions. Alongside the ego, Tolle introduces another concept, the pain body. This is an accumulation of old emotional pain that we carry within us. It's like a shadow that follows us around, influencing our behavior and reactions. Imagine a reservoir holding all of your past hurts, disappointments and traumas. That's your pain body. It feeds on negativity and strives to recreate past pain in your present and future. But here's the good news. Toll suggests that by becoming aware of these constructs, we can start to disidentify from them. We can observe our thoughts and emotions without getting caught up in them. By recognizing the ego and the pain body, we can start our journey towards transcendence and personal transformation. True awakening and fulfillment lie in the present moment, beyond the chatter of the mind. There's a profound truth in these words. Often, we are so lost in our thoughts, our past and our future, that we lose sight of the present moment. It's in this very moment, Eckhart Tolle suggests, where authentic awakening and happiness reside. This is the power of now. It's about transcending the incessant noise of our minds and fully embracing the present. It's about grounding yourself in the here and now, without judgment or distraction. Yet we humans have a tendency to identify with external forms. Our roles, possessions and achievements often become a false sense of self, pulling us away from our true essence. This identification with form can lead us astray, causing us to lose touch with who we truly are. By embracing the now and disidentifying from external forms, we can connect with our timeless essence. Awakening to a deeper level of consciousness, our true essence, is the key to a fulfilling life. Imagine the mind as an ocean, teeming with thoughts, emotions and experiences. It's vast, yes, but there's a depth beneath the surface, a place of stillness and serenity. This is the space of presence or awareness, a realm of consciousness where we encounter our true selves. The concept of presence is not about being physically present, but rather about being mentally and emotionally present. It's about focusing on the here and now, free from the distractions of the past or the anxieties of the future. To be present is to be fully engaged with life as it unfolds moment by moment in its raw, unfiltered beauty. But what stands between us and this state of presence? The answer is the ego. The ego is like a mask, a constructed identity that we wear to navigate the world. It's composed of our thoughts, beliefs and experiences, and it's constantly seeking validation and preservation. While it's a necessary part of our human experience, it can also be a source of suffering and conflict when it dominates our perception of reality. This is where the process of ego dissolution comes into play. It's not about destroying the ego, but rather about recognizing its limitations and reducing its influence over our lives. It's about disidentifying from the ego, understanding that we are not our thoughts, our emotions or our experiences. We are something more profound, more timeless. 
Ego dissolution is a journey of self-discovery and transformation. It's about peeling back the layers of the ego like an onion until we reach our core, our essence. It's about awakening to the reality that we are not separate, isolated beings, but interconnected parts of a larger, more mysterious whole. Through this process, we can experience a profound shift in consciousness, a deepening of our understanding and a broadening of our perspective. We can begin to view ourselves and the world around us in a new light, free from the distortions of the ego. As we dissolve the ego and awaken to our presence, we begin to experience a deeper connection with who we truly are. Imagine a world where individuals live in harmony with each other and the planet. This is the vision of a new earth. In this envisioned world, spiritual enlightenment is not a distant dream, reserved only for the chosen few. Instead, it's a reality accessible to anyone willing to embark on the journey of inner transformation. Eckhart Tolle presents this enlightenment as the dissolution of the egoic mind and the awakening to a deeper, more profound connection with our true essence. This profound shift in consciousness, Tolle suggests, is not just a personal transformation, but an evolutionary leap for humanity as a whole. We are at a pivotal moment in our history, a time of immense potential where we can collectively transition from ego-driven discord to a state of awakened harmony. This is the Earth's evolutionary shift, the dawn of a new Earth. Yet, this transformation is not just about our relationship with ourselves, it also extends to our relationships with others. Conscious relationships, free from the patterns of the ego, become the cornerstone of this new world. These relationships, rooted in presence and authenticity, foster healthier, more fulfilling connections, acting as catalysts for personal and collective growth. Living a purposeful life is another key aspect of this transformation. True purpose, Tolle explains, does not arise from external achievements or roles, but from aligning with the present moment and serving the greater good. As we embody presence and contribute positively to the world, we find our life's purpose and foster the evolution of consciousness. This journey towards a new earth is not just about personal growth or spiritual awakening. It's about collectively fostering a world where harmony, presence and purpose are not mere concepts but lived realities. As we align with the present moment and serve the greater good, we contribute to the evolution of consciousness and the emergence of a new earth.